how's everybody doing today back again with another video for you guys and gals and today what i have for everyone is my full review of the mary 9 universal stand so maybe you're new to the channel or maybe you're returning but pretty much how my process goes is i pick up a product i shoot my unboxing and first impressions i start my full review process and once I feel like I got a handle on everything I want to cover for you guys, then it's full review time. So without further ado, let's jump into this full review. Jumping right in, the first thing I want to talk about with you guys and gals is the overall build quality and design. Now, from a build quality perspective, I have to say Mary 9 did a really, really good job on this one. Now this stand is made out of aluminum and it feels really, really solid. And I have to say, I've had no issues with the overall build quality, okay? No issues whatsoever. Aside from probably these rubber feet, they could have done a better job with this. I think I'm gonna have to find new rubber feet to put in here, because it was installed very sloppily. But for the purposes of this review, I try to use these products exactly how they come out of the box because that's how the manufacturer intends them. So if they make a mistake, I gotta point it out. But other than that, the overall build quality on the stand is really, really good. Talking about the design, I really like the design of this stand as well. So this is a completely foldable stand. Whoops, my bad y'all. So we're not gonna edit that out. This is a completely foldable stand which means it's very portable. So you can just as easily drop this into your pocket, drop this into a purse, drop it into a backpack and be good to go. And once you get where you're going and you wanna whip out your um, phone or tablet, but you don't wanna hold it in your hands, or maybe you had a long day, you wanna come home and just drop it in the stand, you can drop that right in this guy, okay? And also, because of that foldable design, you also have multiple positions that you can put your tablets or phones in as well. So this guy is pretty much compatible with all smartphones and all tablets. And all you really have to do is adjust the positioning to compensate for the weight of said device. And also what's really nice is if you wanna hang this guy, you can do it as well. So maybe you wanna follow along with a recipe in the kitchen, but you don't wanna dirty up your device, you have a little hanging rack, just drop it, drop it on the rack, drop your device in, and follow along and have a good time. So, in terms of the overall design, I have to say it's really, really good. And again, I feel like Mary 9 did a really good job with this one. All right. Oh, did it backwards. Boom, there we go. All right, so in terms of the build quality and design, top notch, top notch indeed. Now, up next, next thing I wanna talk about with you guys is the overall compatible devices. So, as I've said, this guy is pretty much universally compatible with just about any smartphone or any tablet. Now, I don't have a tablet on hand with me today, but it will work with any size smartphone. So you can see here's my Note 3 here. And pretty much, if you find it a little bit off balance, all you have to do is adjust the positioning to compensate for the weight. So works with the Note 3 no problem in landscape mode and portrait mode. So like this and like that. And you can see it does work with phones in cases as well. So you can see I got my essential phone here. Landscape mode, portrait mode, it works no problem. And again, all you really want to do is adjust to compensate for the weight. Now, I do want to point out one thing that I found extremely important. Now, I found that this stand works a lot better if you take your devices out of the case. You get a lot more flush positioning and it's just that much more reassuring that if you bump it, your device isn't gonna fall out. So I find it just works a lot better if you take your devices out of the case, but it does work with pretty much any phone or tablet, whether you have it in the case or not, 
But in my recommendation, you may want to take it out of the case. So there is that. But in terms of device compatibility, again, it should work with just about any smartphone or tablet and you shouldn't have any problems, okay? Up next now, the next thing I want to talk about with you guys is the overall durability of this stand. Now, as most of you guys know, I'm not the most coordinated person in the world, so I'm extremely clumsy. And I'm very happy to report that this stand, this stand stood up to my clumsy lifestyle, or clumsy me, with no issues. I actually dropped this guy a bunch of times, and you can see it still looks and performs as if brand new. Now I do have a few micro scratches on it, but that's just something that happens to metal or aluminum devices over time. So believe it or not, this is still in relatively good condition. But if you guys pick this guy up, the only downside to the durability will you will pick up is, if I could talk, is you will pick up a lot of micro scratches over time. So that is one downside to the durability but it is what it is. But again, in terms of the overall durability, it is top notch. So good stuff there. Now, moving on, I just wanna talk about some positives and negatives of this guy. Summarize real quickly, and then we're gonna wrap it up. We're gonna talk about the price, and I'm gonna give you guys my final thoughts and a recommendation or two. So, talking about the positives, again, the design on this guy, really, really good. Portable, collapsible design, multiple positions, good stuff here. The build quality on this guy, really, really good. Compatible with just about any smartphone or tablet. Just remember, if your device has a little bit of weight to it, you want to adjust accordingly to compensate for weight. And again, also remember that, in my opinion, this guy works better if you take said devices out of cases. Okay, other than that, again, really good stuff uh, on this um, stand here. Now, talking about the negatives, really there's only one negative that I could think of, and that negative would probably be the holder portion here. Where well, you guys know I'm a big fan of the square hook portion, so that's a nice positive there. The rubber grips installed in this guy are really really cheap and I feel like Mary 9 could have done a better job there but other than that I have to say that's pretty much the only negative that I could see about this stand okay so that pretty much wraps up the positives and the negatives now let's talk about the price and one thing I want to state before I tell you all the price of this guy is that I am an Amazon Prime customer, and I did pick this up via Amazon, and kudos to Amazon and Mary9, because this guy came rather quickly, and I didn't have any issues. But, if you're not an Amazon Prime customer, you will have to factor in shipping and handling, and taxes, if you're in a state where taxes are applicable. But for me, since I'm an Amazon Prime customer, the only thing I had to factor in was the taxes. So, after taxes at checkout, this guy ran me, I think it was $6 and change, you can call it $7. So, you guys are probably wondering, for $7, can I recommend that you guys pick up this stand? And I would have to say, yes. Okay? I think the positives of the stand greatly outweigh the negatives of the stand. And at that price of $7, why not? Why not indeed? You'd be surprised how often these little stands come in handy. And the fact that it's so portable, why not just have one on hand to take with you, drop one in your bag, or maybe you're a college student and you can't afford a laptop, but you have a tablet. So you have a tablet and keyboard case, or a tablet and a Bluetooth keyboard. Get you one of these nice stands. Drop your tablet on, you already have your keyboard set up, and there you go. Just like you have a laptop without paying the super hefty laptop prices. So, again, can I recommend this universal stand be picked up from you guys? Yes. 
Now, if you guys and gals enjoyed the video, please help your boy out and give it a thumbs up. That really does help me out. You don't know how much. If you want to see more raw, uncut content like this, because you never really know what's going to happen when I push record, please remember to hit the subscribe button down below and click off the notification bell icon right next to it so you guys get notified when I drop new videos. As always, if this video piqued your guys' interest and you're interested in picking this stand up exactly like how you see it here in this video, all links to where to purchase this stand will be located down below in the video description. So interest is peaked, check out the video description. It's going to be like a one-stop shop down there and you should be good to go. I'll also have in the video description links to all the other stands that I picked up and their full reviews as well. So maybe you don't like this stand. Got a few other stands you could take a look at and probably going to pick up a bunch more. So I should have something on the channel for everyone. And if not, it will come eventually. So that being said, if you guys and gals know anyone out there looking for some high quality, affordable devices and products at some really great prices, please share with them my channel because I'm doing this for everyone because we all deserve the best. That being said, I hope everyone has a great day and I will catch you guys and gals in the next video. Peace.